and we do need to say enough is enough. And it's a lot of times we got to come up with something afterwards. Once we out here yelling and screaming and trying to get our message heard, we need to come up with ways that make sure that this doesn't happen again. Because we shouldn't have to come out every time there's an incident. We should be able to prevent this from keep happening over and over. They're killing innocent people every day. Like, I, I feel like the only answer is, is, like, we have to protest. We have to, like, group together and show that, like, this can't be happening anymore. Like, it has to stop. I can say as a white person, it's important for me because a lot of African Americans, uh, and rightly so, feel that a lot of white people don't think it's any of their concern or it's an issue that impacts them. And of course, I don't have to deal with the racial prejudice they do. And this might sound corny, but whatever. At the end of the day, we're all people. And even if you can't literally like relate to what somebody's experiencing, you should be able to relate to them as a human being. And the fact that people are being violently oppressed in this country by police.